right. Get the fuck out of here right now, bro. Yo, y'all got the popcorn? <laughs> yeah. Oh, here we go. Oh, I'm not tolerating this shit. No way, no how, man. Slamming his headphones down. Okay. Uh, imagine, let, uh, since you guys probably aren't catching all the little subtleties of where he's trying to imitate Alpha behavior. Imagine this was Brad Pitt or Leonardo DiCaprio and they were portraying an Alpha, an alpha character. Or even, for those of you that are familiar with my channel, imagine I was in this situation. Do you think I'd be like, no way, no how, man. Boom. Like slam the headphones down. It's just ultra cringe. What's up guys, John Anthony here from John Anthony Lifestyle. Today we're gonna look at Myron Gaines pretending to be an alpha bad boy, okay? And being absolutely incongruent as fuck, okay? But it's a perfect example of a super beta guy trying to act alpha tough guy, okay? Trying to imitate what he thinks an alpha guy would do, okay? And failing miserably. We're gonna show three examples of this, but before we continue, if you're not yet a subscriber, there's new videos every single day, uh, practical, straightforward dating advice, please press the subscribe button below. Press the notification bell to be alerted to those new videos every day. And if you want to master the dating game for real, okay, these guys are saying on their fucking channel banner, number one dating podcast. Okay, we've revealed uh, Walter Weeks on the right over here as working for Wix.com as recently as like four months ago. I, I believe he probably still is. Okay, he wears his little fucking stupid CEO chain. Okay, and it was shown that he bought fake press releases. He's obviously not in shape whatsoever, fresh and fit, my ass. Okay, Myron, I have a screenshot we'll put up. He approached me for coaching not that long ago, was in the low hundred lay count, okay, and admitted it, from his personal email that he's banging girls between the range of four and eight. Let me be perfectly clear that four and eight range does not encompass nines and tens. It's, oh, we're always just slamming nines and tens, okay? And it also encompasses fours. So he's going below average and banging out fucking nasty trash, okay? These guys are not dating experts. These guys are not fitness experts. They're trying to put on some kind of fucking reality TV thing. That's why their subscribers are growing. Uh, people will come on and say, oh, you're jealous because they're more popular, okay? These guys don't know even the tiniest bit of what I know about dating. These guys are not real experts, okay? And I showed in the, in the videos. We'll, we'll show the thumbnails for the Myron and the, and the Fresh Prince videos, that these guys just came and copied different people's shit. They don't know shit, okay? Myron is not alpha whatsoever. And I'm gonna go through an analysis of that in a moment. And uh, Fresh Prince CEO, <laughs> again, buying fresh <laughs> fake press releases. Uh, he was married to an overweight Latina woman. And he has no qualifications, okay? He's just posing next to fucking jets and cards that aren't his. These guys are a total fucking joke, faking everything including their expertise, okay? And I also revealed in a video about Myron that he's paying girls. There was a girl that said he paid her $1,000 to fuck him, to fuck the girl, okay? And offered her $300 to come on the show, which she refused, okay? So these other girls that come on the show, uh, it, it's very likely that, they're, that, that the vast majority of them are being paid uh, and or they're just using these guys to try to get clout on social media. These guys are total fucking losers, okay? And make sure you check out those videos I referenced in the thumbnails, and I'll put the links in the description to the, the two exposed videos on Myron and Fresh and Fit, and also the one about Myron paying girls, okay? So let's jump in and it, it be, it make <laughs> keep careful attention here. Oh, by the way, in, in the eight-week eight week mentorship link, uh, the free 30-minute call, that link is in the description, okay? So don't forget that. But let's be perfectly clear here. These guys are not alphas whatsoever, okay? The one on the right mumbles a lot. He's out of shape. Uh, Walter over here. Again, these guys came out of nowhere. They're, they're nobodies. They have no real expertise. They were just good at generating a buzz and all this stuff. And Myron, okay, he, he sucks at dating. And, and it, it's just really interesting to watch him try to pretend to be alpha. So let's jump right into it here. First world country like the United States or, um, you know, or Canada or Australia, whatever that has um, the Duluth model of DV, if you guys know what I'm talking about, which basically, can you stop interrupting me? Not. And like laughing and making like faces and all that? I, I respectfully listen to you, right? No, I'm, I'm not even. I just feel like men's opinion is interesting and laughable. No, laughable. La like, no, no, I'm not even being funny towards you specifically because a lot of men feel your, your point. Like, it's not just you. The way I'm laughing, that's how I really feel. Like, men feel that way. This is so cringe. Look, Walter over here, he's like, come on, Myron, try to be cool so we can uh, uh, get some more attention, some more views. And Myron's like, okay, how do I, 
how do I calculate this to act like the cool guy, the tough guy? Okay, let's see. And watch how for someone that's really alpha like myself, that's dated lots of beautiful girls all around the world. And I, and I by the way, I talked to other alpha guys that saw this. And here's an example of one of them. Okay, this, these are three different uh, clips. I said, did you feel like Myron was acting alpha when he kicked the girl off his show? No, I thought it was super beta. Easy to be tough in front of little girls. He's too sensitive, gets super triggered all the time, takes everything personally. It's a form of compensation. Yeah, and, and Myron was texting me being ultra cringe, trying to beg me uh, a couple years ago to, to teach him a boot camp for $500 because he was broke. Do not mess with the Punisher. And, and my friend was saying such pseudo alpha shit. It's very obvious to real alpha guys that this is pseudo alpha behavior, but what, you'll see what I'm talking about here. Just watch how it's not congruent at all with who he is personally. A lot of men feel that way. It don't even be you. It's Walter's like, oh my God, I can't believe we made it this far with our fake press releases and all of our fake skills and, and paying these girls to come on our show. I can't believe it's actually working. A specific man. Like, I'm not laughing at you as a specific man, but a lot of men feel your way that men are, are excluded, but then they be wrong. I don't. But then they be wrong. I don't think it's funny, huh? I think you should let him speak it's just a respect thing it's not even yeah. a woman yeah, thing. When you were giving your, thing. It's just when you were giving your opinion no one laughed at you no one said anything right. that's fine where they let you talk okay kick out cam I'm yeah good. you know what man fuck this shit yo just leave yo fuck this shit man just leave he's like he's like all right time to time to make a, a pseudo alpha stand here watch how cringe this is no 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 i'll never laugh at you again no 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 just yo large get out of here bro facts i'm dead i'm dead serious get out of here get out of here bro Facts. Dead serious. Punisher wants her out, man. Facts. That's, that, so that, this, this is like beyond cringe. This is so fucking retarded. And, and you guys don't realize how many layers of fabrication are going on here. You have two guys pretending to be experts in uh, dating, fitness, and, bi and business, okay, which they are not at all in any of those three categories, that are faking press releases, that are faking real skills, that are ripping off people's products. They're just rehashing generic da dating advice, generic fitness advice. And they're just, this is just basically like reality TV. Okay, people just watch this shit for entertainment. That's why it's getting so much popularity. Now, now this is like the kind of shit you would see on reality TV. But let's not fucking make any mistake about, any mistake about it, that this is not fucking clear off of behavior. These guys are not fucking tearing down nines and tens. Myron even admitted that he's banging between a four and an eight range. Okay, uh, let's, let's watch this, this ridiculousness unfold. Uh, no, no I'm dead. I, I made my decision. Get the fuck out. Okay. Yeah. I'm not, I wasn't being rude. No, you have been rude. I made my decision. Get the fuck out. Facts. Yo, LJ, get her out of here, bro. And I've given you... They're in, they're in this fucking <laughs> Miami... Con this is all so sad. This is the kind of shit... It's like when you have Tyler Durden on camera trying to be like, Oh, yeah, like I just bang all these stunners. It's very obviously not true. Okay, and it's very clear to any guy that has even slightly alpha characteristics. Many chances. I'm I tired did, of it. I did, I did, I'm sorry. All I right, take I over. Have I'm tired of... The, the most important point to note here, I want to be very clear, this is not just hating. This is not just baseless hating. This is a guy not being congruent with, with who he really is. Okay, He's demonstrated himself being ultra beta in countless places, countless videos. When he used to fucking bother me and Alex and playing with fire for coaching, and we were like, get away from us, you're super weird, you're super cringe. And he couldn't catch any social cues, and he, he's just a huge loser. He's just a super weirdo. Okay, he's trying to, what he thinks an alpha guy would do, he's trying to like mimic that script and failing miserably. Okay, so just watch how this is not part of who he is. Phones, get up, get the fuck out. Um, how many um, times do I gotta tell you? No, I wasn't. I um, oh, no. And look at Walter; he's trying to act shocked. No, no joke on the internet. No, no. Jose, okay. get her out of here, bro. Understand? No, that's fine. And I'm gonna escort you out too. Make sure you don't fuck up my shit. No. I'm gonna escort you out. Make sure you don't fuck up my shit. Boom. And everyone watching, like, oh shit! This is like what shows like Jerry Springer. Or, um, you know, other trash TV is based on, okay? The reality shows like, oh, man, like, oh, no, he didn't, right? Like, it's, it's really fucking sad, okay? As if the girl is going to go, like, fuck up a bunch of his apartment now, okay? This is all for show. This is all for more views. And so people can be like, yo, but I actually had a couple people message me. Oh, man, look, did you see Myron kick out there? It's like, give me a fucking break. Okay. I don't watch their channel, but, but watching <laughs> this stupid exchange for like five seconds, I'm just going to keep moving. Cause there's a couple other really lame cringe exchanges we have to go through. I wasn't being rude. No, you are. Now get the fuck out. Man. No, I, I didn't even I'm going to tell you again. Oh I shit. Ain't, I ain't going to tell you again. Walter's like feeding into, Oh shit, bro. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And, the, and one of the funniest things he calls himself, Frank Castle. 
oh, which is a Punisher reference. Okay, for any of you that have seen the movie The Punisher, the dude's ultra jacked. He's ultra alpha. The frame he carries is of a real alpha. Okay, he's he's like fucking doing all kinds of real alpha shit with real alpha behavior, and it's congruent with who he is in that movie. Okay, now here's a guy trying to rip off an alpha character's uh, real alpha presence and try to imitate it. But the problem is he's a super cringe beta and it doesn't fucking work. It's exactly what Tyler Durden did. RST Tyler Owen Cook. Oh, Brad Pitt seemed really cool in Fight Club. I'm going to call myself Tyler Durden. Okay, but, but the problem is, in reality, he's Edward Norton's character. He's the fucking spineless loser. Okay, he's, he's the one that has no balls, that can't stand up for himself because he's a super cringe beta. Okay, so let's watch the rest of this cringe interaction. No, 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 get out. That's why my dog doesn't like me. I know. Yeah. Can I, I know. That girl's fucking pooch here. Okay, well, fellas, this is part two. She's like, can I get my $300 back that I paid you to go on the show? Um, I can't say I didn't see this coming because, uh, yeah, bro. I, I saw it coming. Yeah. Yo, I don't, I don't know what, I don't know what she was on, but uh, that was not. Look at, look at him, with his fucking, does he have his jeans curled up at the, <laughs> at the bottom with his little glasses? No, get out and don't fuck up my shit. I want her out. Facts. Oh my god, it's, it's just so cringe. It's, it, you guys, uh, I don't know if you guys can even realize this, cause, cause guys that, that aren't even normally being alpha can't even process what's happening here because they don't know how a real alpha should act so like oh it seems kind of alpha it's an imitation okay it's the same thing that tyler durden does when he's on his camera or when he's doing infield it's a guy thinking okay and, and again first of all girls see right through this instantly okay that's why he's not able to get nines and tens that's why he self-admits that he's banging the four and eight range okay and we as we saw he's paying girls a thousand dollars as well okay to to move up in the products file for the eights, he pays them a thousand dollars. Okay, but girls see through this instantly. But the narrative that's going on here for Myron or for Tyler Durden when they do these things, okay, how would an alpha guy act? I'm gonna try to imitate with forced outer game actions, meaning, okay, I think an alpha guy would do this, so I'm gonna do this. I think an alpha guy would do this, so I'm gonna do this. And it's very uh, transparent that that's not at all alpha behavior, and it's very transparent that he's just acting. Okay, and acting very poorly. So a real alpha, he would have these internal frames and internal mindsets, and he wouldn't need to think what would an alpha guy do because he already embodies those characteristics. Okay, all his verbals and his subcommunications are already fully dialed in to be congruent with being an alpha guy, because that's who he is internally. So this is actually a very important video. No, this is not just hating. It's just a perfect example of two guys that think they're like kings of the world and that have tricked and deceived a ton of people. Again, check in the description where I go into full detail about Myron and full detail about Walter Weeks, who's known as Fresh Prince CEO. Okay, this guy was building websites three years, three months ago. Three, <laughs> almost said three years ago. Three months ago, okay, we're working for Wix.com. And then since they launched their Fresh and Fit podcast, he said that like that work stopped in December. I doubt it, okay? So, and yeah, I got my hair cut. So this, this hair transplant shit is, is uh, somewhat of the same length now. Now it just has to regrow. Looks like a fucking mohawk here for now. But yeah, let's continue. There's two more to get through or to try to move quickly here. Like yeah, 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 yeah. No, no. I, I could tell. I was barking at her when she came. Yo, I don't know. Look at, look at Myron. He's he's trying to be <laughs> Abdu. That's his real name. Look at Abdu. He's fucking trying to be the cool guy here with his rolled up jeans at the bottom. Look, I don't know what she's on. I don't, dude, that, that chick is crazy. Yeah. Like, Shit, duh. Hello, Yo, my doctor. <laughs> when she showed up, Myron was in a bad mood the whole time. I'm like, damn. Oh, Myron was in a bad mood. So now... It, He's basically like rage quitting here is, is on top of it. Yo. Like a fucking pussy. But you, you know what's the worst part? Like, he put, Is that camera on like yeah, it is. No, 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 no. All right, so we'll look at how he tries to be cool when he comes back. Let's see. Okay, let's hear Let's hear his. Now he has to show how he's like the cool guy. Transitioning back? Cool? Yeah, yeah. We can yeah. start over. Yeah, that'll be perfect. Yeah, what move was from, she on, dude? I move her mic off the table. She must be on something, okay, because she, she talked back to myron okay, what, what is she on i feel like she's on something i don't uh, know but it's the only explanation she must be on something the real explanation is is myron's trying to be the cool guy because he was in a bad mood and he rage quitted like a beta pussy under the under the pretense of being an alpha badass okay yo carlo 
When you were speaking, I was looking at you like, yo, this chick is I was like, gone. Yo, Kyle, what do you think of that paid press release while I was, was posing next to those jets in the in the, the cars that weren't mine? What do you think? What do you think of that? You know what? I, I was like, oh, I was so confused. I was like, dude, he, he makes a point though. Right? Like, he was just trying to say his point, yeah. and she's first of all, I don't think. Okay, let's hear Frank Castle. Let's hear his explanation of that situation. It's funny that men get charged more for. <laughs> Also, I just don't think cases it's like I don't think that's funny, but she was laughing the whole time. I just don't yeah. think it's funny, also, that like men. Uh, it's, uh, Carla, uh, can oh, you speak to the mic? And uh, Sarah, can you move to the left a little bit, please? Thank you. Uh, just turn yourself. Thank you. Now we're perfect. All right. <laughs> yeah, every time, <laughs> every time, home, yo, real talk. Every time homeboy brings a girl, <laughs> she gets kicked out. <laughs> no, honestly, like, look, I'm all about. Come on, I want to hear. Look, at Myron's trying to, like, you know, he's, he's like, all right, man, I think they bought it. I think they bought it. Look, you can see he's like making a terse lip. He's like, you can see in other videos too, but when he's all like upset, he's like making this like, what like kind of stern face. Okay. He's, he's like melting inside because he's a beta pussy, but he's trying to be cool through the whole thing. Being a feminist and all that <laughs> shit, but it's not fair because Let's get the glasses men back on so we are can always put into this category. And every mm -hmm. time they look, look at this girl here gonna give her insight speak it's like oh they can't say anything because they're automatically rapists and they're automatically this and they're automatically that and it's like let him talk yeah mm -hmm. like you're not True. giving right. him the benefit of the doubt she was blah, laughing blah. Me. that uh okay here we go when right. people disrespect you guys yeah, you just understand here we go here we go here we go here we go this is this is one of the best parts here here's the lesson guys everybody get your notepads out uh, a total fucking beta pussy okay over here on the left that's massively scamming you all Massively scamming you all. Cannot make that clear enough. Massively scamming you all. A pseudo expert. These guys are about as fake as it gets. Okay, it should be called fake and fit. Okay, let's hear his his lesson and his wisdom. We're all so eager. Stand that uh, when Sorry. people disrespect you, especially women, you you can't let that shit slide, bro. Like I was like, no. you know what? I'll give her a chance. She came with one of our friends, but uh, nah. I ain't gonna do it anymore. You know what I'm saying? Like it's like it, you know what I'm saying. I'm not gonna do it. No facts, bro. Because the thing is, is that you know when you give them an inch, they take a mile. And yeah, I just didn't want to deal with her no more. So it is what it is, guys. You know, you gotta you gotta have your boundaries and be willing to act on them. It is what it is. That is not okay for whoever fucking took a lesson about that being a boundary. That was about the fucking weakest boundarying I've ever seen in my life. Okay, that was just a fucking you know guy that doesn't know what the fuck he's doing. Okay, I don't know how the, this is the internet here, okay, in, in most fields, this wouldn't be able to fly, okay, when you, like, if you were claiming to be a poker pro, or you were claiming to be some pro in any field where you had to actually show real evidence of, of winning and doing these things, Walter Weeks on the left here, this man right here, okay, was nobody, four months ago, he's still nobody, uh, officially, but he's, he's, tricked everyone to think that he's some big guru he's tricked everyone to think that he's a master about dating about fitness about business just because he can put on a ceo necklace just because he can uh pay for a fake press release which i already exposed just because he can say whatever he wants on the camera he's claiming to bang over a thousand girls the best guys that know in the game are at 600 to 700 range right now okay and, and this nobody who's overweight who was married to an overweight latina okay married 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 with kids okay i show that too is claiming a thousand lake count. Full fabrication. He's like, what sounds good? Oh, that, that, a real guy in the game that, that has a real count of 1352, which is what it is at currently. Oh, he has a big count. I'm just going to say over a thousand. That sounds cool. Okay. Myron on the left, Amru Foodle or whatever the fuck his stupid name is. Uh, he comes on and this guy was just asking me for coaching a couple years ago. He's like, hey, I'm in the low hundred count. That's, that's an average year for me. Okay, my best year was 246 lays, which he still currently is not at. My best year beat Myron's entire lifetime count. And he's going to say this is the best dating podcast on the internet. No, it's the best tricking podcast on the internet. Fake and fit. Okay, like legitimate. These guys are very good at scamming and faking. I will give them that. Okay, but that's not at all credible. Okay, I've shown that they're paying girls to come on the show. I've shown they have no real qualifications. I've shown they're faking all kinds of shit. To, to build up their credibility. They're lying their asses off. Okay, they're fucking faking press releases. They're posing next to cars and with girls in, in jets that, that, they didn't, that, that are not theirs. Okay, it's just a whole facade. It's all smoke and mirrors. And whoever's fucking paying these guys, if you're someone watching this and you're paying these guys, you're a fucking total idiot.
okay? Let me get back to the focus of this because I could just go on and on. Most of that shit's said in those other videos I made and you can see in the links in the description. But let's continue with this fun ordeal. We'll jump to the next video in a second. Because if she walks on you once, she's going to keep doing it, bro. That's just... If she walks on you once, she she going to do again, bro. I, I ain't no playing no more, okay? Facts. He's even changed up his lingo, okay, to relate to the audience here. The way it, things are with life, whether it's men, women, whatever it is, there's a reason why bullies keep bullying you, you know what I'm saying? Well, you got to put your foot down. There's platonic respect, though. So. Why haven't you responded to any of my claims then, Myron? Where's, where's your retort? Where's your explanation, okay, with all the different facts that, that show that you're totally full of shit, including your stupid fucking partner over here on the right? Why haven't you retorted to anything that I've called you out about, Okay. I know you know about it because the guy that exposed that you were paying a girl, he said that you called him up immediately and you were furious for that being exposed right after I put that video out. Okay, so I know you're finding out about this shit. You have nothing to say because you have egg on your face and you're a fucking loser. Oh, like, you know, I feel like you're making it seem like... Okay, I, look, here he is, a tense face. He's like, try, he's like trying so desperately. Desperately, desperately, desperately. Pretend to be alpha. Let me, let's give you guys a closer look. Okay. He's trying so hard. He's like really hoping that these guys are going to believe his lesson about making a stand, his lesson about boundaries, his lesson about, you know, being the tough guy and blah, 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 blah. No, this is all for views. Okay. Look at the fucking fake fights on Jerry Springer and shit. Th these guys are building a fucking fake environment to just generate views. Okay. Let's go on to the next one here. Do not mess with the Punisher. Okay. This one's from... 10 days ago. He's like, this is my show. Yeah. yeah, yeah but do you guys want to see her or him? Right. You guys, came here, you, came, you guys came here to talk to us, right? So. Okay, then. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh, oh. No, 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 Let me set this shit straight. No, 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 and, and and a lot of the proceeds are going to bring these girls on the show. Okay, the, the whole thing is so fucking sad. View us. <laughs> Let me say, about nah, dating. Nah, nah, nah bro. Nah, 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 We'll make more back when we kick you off our, our show. First of all, we clear. don't need you guys, but... Oh! Okay. There we go. There's, that's actually the real the real facts here. These bitches are like, yeah, uh, we took the payment that you paid us to come on the show. And it gives us a little boost on social media to be on a popular channel. Okay. We think you guys are fucking losers. I doubt they ever banned any of these girls. Not that they'd even want to in the first place. These girls are all gross. But let's hear how he handles again with his with his massive alpha behavior. This is a great opportunity, and we're grateful. An opportunity for you guys. Okay. Yeah, exactly. There it is. This is a great opportunity. Okay. Translation: You guys are huge fucking losers that we would never bang, even if you were the last two men on earth. However, you have a bunch of fools following your shit because they don't know any better. Because on the internet, you can claim to be a CEO. Because on the internet, you can claim to bang over a thousand girls, okay? I back up all of that shit with proof. I show more proof of banging over a thousand girls than anyone. I have a whole video of over an hour long where I go through all the full details, okay? But then you have imitators and fucking huge beta pussies that come out and say, hey, we're the man. We're really good at dating. Modern life dating. He's going to sit and fucking slander the shit out of me up and down all across the internet. Never shown an infield. I don't even think he's recorded an infield. Never shown pictures and hookup situations. I don't think he has those either. Never shown fucking anything, okay? But he's going to come and say, look, he was drunk. Look at this. He's going to just, just fight in the mud and try to take low blows and attack my credibility, okay? And look at these fuckers. These fuckers, I showed their paying girls come on their show. These fuckers have no real expertise. And now these girls are, are like standing up for themselves. So let's hear what they say here. Thank so you. I just want to make that very clear because I don't want no girls coming on here thinking like, oh, we're like the prize. We're spe like, fuck out of here. You're not the prize. You're just the girl. We paid $300 and you can get some boosts on your social media. But our followers are going to pay us a bunch more. And we actually make a positive return on investment off paying you guys to come on the show. OK, we don't need you. We can pay other girls to come on the show. You guys are on our platform. And I'm not because another girl tried to say that. Say no, that don't before. take it that way. We, okay. we, we I just were here very, for you guys. I just want to be very we're clear here to about support. that. I'm from Miami, so I'm here to support. Yeah, you. no, I just want to make that of very course. clear. And Walter's always in the corner like, mm -hmm, like 
he's even more cringe. Okay, uh, someone said that uh, that Mister Mister Thousand Lake Count claim over here on the right in the blue shirt with his fucking lo- massive loser CEO necklace. He's not a CEO of jack shit. Okay, this fucker with claiming the thousand lays, he's just trying to be fucking cool. But someone was like, <laughs> Myron makes Walter look like James Bond. Okay, and Myron sucks at game massively too. So what does that say? We don't need yeah. girls no. on this show. We're gonna be successful. We don't need girls on this show. We can be successful just putting out our scam fake image to everybody. You know, just having a, some paid girls in the background helps, and we can create drama. And I can show that I'm an alpha tough guy and all this stuff. Okay, but we don't need them, right? We can just buy more. You're not the prize. Okay, it, this is oh, it's it's so sad on so many levels. Well, let's just keep watching here. The whole purpose of this video is to watch him try to flex pseudo alpha behavior. Successful without you guys. This of is a course. perk that we do late night. We do a main show. So a lot of girls That's get it twisted thinking like, oh, we need girls. Like, we don't no, need you guys no, no. at all. We, we know that. Okay. Just so want to make that clear. What you bring us on here for? What you bring us on here Well, listen, if you don't want to be here, you can get the fuck out. Nobody said I don't want to be here. Why do you have to go from zero no, to No, because you're, cause you've already been disrespect, disrespectful How? in the beginning. Please, Why? Please Why? Tell me. What is Have I been disrespectful today? Have I been disrespectful I feel like it's a masculine. I've been here. Please tell me. Toxic. Walter's like, well, I don't know if you've been disrespectful. I'm too busy building a scam image, and I was married to this big Latina. But I have to side with Frank Castle on this one. What Remember I, at the beginning, right? Done? No, at the beginning, right? You said you were blocking him, right? Oh. He was blocking, he was blocking you. me because you even asked. Can Somebody I? Somebody come look at this. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay. She was just playing. At this okay. point, okay. I just, I, like part of me wants to go. I used to watch this show, Nathan, for you. Okay, and he would like fuck with the media. He made like a, a, a spoof video called like Dumb Starbucks, where like he made or he does he does these things undercover. Like he staged like a like a, a goat rescuing a pig in the water, but it was all like staged. He had like a whole crew and all this shit, and the news picked it up and it was circulated all over the international uh, news sources. And like everyone's like, you can learn something from this humans, animals helping animals, and this and that. Okay, and it was all fucking staged. I think it would be funny as fuck to go grab a random guy off the street and like show his whole background that he has zero dating expertise, zero fitness expertise, zero business expertise. Okay. And then put some high powered marketing behind him and him go on camera and be like, yeah, I can do this and do this and do this. And then build him up a big channel and then say, Hey, look at this. You dumb fucking idiots. This guy doesn't know shit. This is a fucking random guy off the street, okay? Because that's what 95% of this industry is. It's random fucking total idiots that don't know shit about the game, okay? Who has um, hundreds of infields? Any of these guys? Walter? Myron? Rolo Tomasi? Rich Cooper? Okay, do any of them have one infield? Modern Life Dating? Ryan Stone? No. They're all fucking married or in in relationships with super ugly girls. That's their only receipt is bottom of the barrel trash. That's their only fucking picture that they have with the girl, and it's fucking disgusting, okay? They don't have hundreds of infields. I'm gonna start breaking down full-length infield polls on my channel weekly on YouTube Lives. That's right, okay? I have over 100 infield polls. I can do this for a long time, okay? I can even record more if I run out, okay? And that's gonna give away a lot of fucking shit, okay? But I'm not gonna give my full method, that'll still be reserved for the paid programs, but I am going to walk through exactly how I'm, what I'm doing from walking up to say hello all the way to taking the girl home. And then the haters will come in. It's all fake. It's all hookers. Okay, but guess what? There's objections. There's negative reactions. There's real shit happening because it's real fucking footage. Okay, and you guys can't make any of that because you have no fucking game. And they have no pictures in hookup situations. I have, I have hundreds. Okay, and it, with pictures of women in general, I have several thousand. Okay, and uh, testimonial, hundreds of testimonials of shocking fucking things. You could say hundreds of testimonials are all paid actors. These guys come on and give the entire fucking backstory. Okay, and they talk about failures too. And they talk about negative things too. That's all fucking real. I would never ever fake one infield. I would never ever fake one testimonial. I would never ever hire a student, hire a fucking hooker for a student or for an infield or go around banging hooker. Because guess what? If I did any of that shit. Okay, and it leaked out with real proof, which let me remind you guys, there's no been not even a shred of real proof about any of these these slander claims that are going around about me. Okay, the only real proof was fabricated screenshots that Modern Life Dating put up that CoffeeZilla had already debunked and rejected as being fake. Okay, and I'm going to make a whole separate video devoted to that. But there's at least 10 different things that prove that those are fake screenshots. 
okay, including the fact that that picture was taken from 2013 off one of my product pages for the WhatsApp picture. And why would I have a picture from 2013 on WhatsApp with a girl nonetheless? I've never had a WhatsApp picture with a girl that would fucking cock block me with new leads, okay? And they're typing capitals in every beginning of sentence. Whoever fucking made up this shit didn't research me very well. I never type with capitals at the beginning of sentences. They said, oh, this assistant James or whatever the fucking name was. Never had an assistant with that name. When CoffeeZilla said take a screen capture of the recording showing that it's coming from his phone number, they couldn't do it because it's fake. And they said, oh, well, uh, it's because it was on a company uh, phone and I had to give it. I've never had any fucking company phones. Okay? I've never even had that many people working for me. Just super close friends that were running programs for me, except in the one case of Ryan. Okay, which is just a guy that is now I have on documented record that he's gone and slandered over 30 different things. Okay, and I sent him a legal notice and I'll be moving forward with legal action on, on that. Okay, and I'm going to publicize all this shit when I do it. Okay, and it's just so fucking off the rails that you have all these people that aren't proving shit that come on and try to be experts. Okay, rant over. Let's watch the pseudo alpha behavior a little bit more. Get to the next video, and then I have other shit to do. At this, this point, let's let's it, take several seats. Because I can if you want me to. No, no, no. no, no. no. no you're, you're already done. Get out. I'm dead ass. All right. Get out. I'm dead ass. You're out. This is so sad. Out. Take your headphones. Get out. Let's take several seats, serious. guys. It's okay. I'm dead ass. Like get the fuck out of here, bro. Like mm -hmm. I'm not gonna tolerate no chick coming on here thinking like, oh. I ain't gonna tolerate no chick on I'm not here. I'm dead ass, man. Facts. Oh, I'm not gonna do any of that shit, yo. I'm special, but I don't. I just like. You can walk out now. You can walk out. Okay. We're all Already. And they're getting out. We're all special, guys. And they get her out. This is this is like their like moments of of uh, trying to like flex their pseudo alpha. I'm sure like all the dopamine's going off. They're like, yeah, we get to look like we're cool. Finally, to all these fucking people that don't know any better. Okay. Well, the real alphas know better. You're not tricking anyone. You guys are huge fucking losers. And this is like really pathetic type of behavior here that they're exhibiting. <laughs> Okay, well you can wait downstairs then. No, right you, yo, you are not waiting out here. You're not waiting in here. That was fast. You okay. are not waiting here. Already, holy smokes. Ayende. Holy smokes, fizzy doodle. Get the fuck out of here right now, bro. Yo, y'all got the popcorn? <laughs> yeah. Oh, here we go. Oh, I'm not tolerating this shit. No way, no how, man. Slamming his headphones down. Okay. Uh, imagine, let, uh, since you guys probably aren't catching all the little subtleties of where he's trying to imitate alpha behavior, imagine this was Brad Pitt or Leonardo DiCaprio and they were portraying an alpha, an alpha character. Or even, for those of you that are familiar with my channel, imagine I was in this situation. Do you think I'd be like, no way, no how, man. Boom. Like slam the headphones down. It's just ultra cringe. This is not a fucking alpha guy. Not even slightly. Okay. And anyone that knows this guy, I know a lot of people that know this guy. He's a huge fucking loser. He's only like a, a star on the show okay and it's all a facade okay so let's let's watch the the poor acting <laughs> yo this is just started camera. man who is it this lights just camera started. action oh oh, oh. oh please oh, come on don't leave her outside though yo guys real talk this is miami though this is live man we oh Ew. I thought this was gonna be a great show. Like, what's going it on right now? It is a great show because we're. Uh, it's okay. It's okay. Mylon, uh, calm, calm down. Yeah, relax. I, it's okay. I think the fact that she was kind of like he's he's blocking me. Fresh. It's our show. Annoying. So I I get it, but it's like this is so stupid. This is <laughs> it's like no different than like terribly awful reality TV. Okay, and these guys are claiming to be dating experts. Yo, like you know what I'm saying? And it's all like fucking. It's just like very low brow, like trash, like trashy. Come on, guys. We need to calm down. Yes. Walter's like, oh, let me get some bonus footage so we can look even cooler on the internet. It's fucking pop belly. Of course. No, no, no. no. Of course not. Especially just now. That's so crazy. You're right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you, we know. Just stand your ground. We're women. We're women. We're, women. We're, we're gonna. At this point, I could. If you didn't catch that, Myron's like, at this point, I could literally throw out myself. It, it's it's so cringe at so many levels. Right? There's, I don't want to make this video too long. It's already getting out of control. I made a lot of my points already. We'll look at one more. Act like ladies, okay? And not that she wasn't acting like one because she stood her ground, you know. Everybody has 
a voice and wants to be heard and are we still hey let's let's get to the lesson that frank punisher is going to teach <laughs> frank castle is going to teach us look at him here he is he's ready to He's ready to lay down the law. I got tickets. I'm gonna go. Let, okay. Let, uh, let Mar Sorry about that, guys. Woo. It's okay. It's okay. Nah, man. Like, it's, like it's. Nah, man. Like, you know, all these people think we're cool, so we gotta be cool, Walter. We gotta act cool, bro. Nah, I'm not having that, man. Facts. Yo, before we start with chit chat attitude, yeah, before like, we start, let's like, nah, bro. Let's like, down, let's I... that's all you can say. Like, nah, bro. Nah, I'm not playing, bro. Nah, bro. Ugh. Fucking go fucking run through that glass or, and hop off the balcony without a parachute, please. It's it's too cringe. I cannot handle it. I hear where you're coming from. I hear both sides. I do. No, there's one side, bro. You, you're at someone else's platform. This is an opportunity for you. Don't come on here thinking like, oh, um, you should be. I got to find. <laughs> I need to go through like my old WhatsApp text archives because Myron used to fucking incessantly harass me uh, trying to get coaching. Okay, and I and I showed that email in the beginning, where he's like, I've been uh, I've been with the, the low hundred count. He's like, none of my crew knows how to get girls. Oh, what a surprise! That's why they haven't shown any receipts except for the busted, ugly trash that they married. And he would always be like, Hey, just let me have a boot camp for five hundred dollars. Let me have a boot camp. And he was like making the most cringe remarks ever. And Alex from Playing with Fire knew of him, and I was like, Dude, this guy is super fucking weird. And he's super fucking cringe and he's annoying as fuck. And I had to block him. Okay. And now he's like a star just because he's tricked a bunch of people on YouTube. Okay. And he can pretend to be the cool guy now. This is like his dream come true. Same with Walter. That they actually get to pretend to be cool. This is exactly what Tyler Durden got to live out. He's like, okay, let's think here. I'm a, I have about one of the lowest SMVs that I could possibly have. Okay. I'm a short, balding, overweight ginger who acts erratic. And when I was on the boot camp with Tyler in 2012, when I was at 103 lay count, I followed around watching him get absolutely annihilated. And I would ask the girls what their most uh, common feedback was. And they would say, weird, creepy, gay, awkward, uh, cringe. None of them were interested in him, in him at all. And, they, and, they were, and I was, I've asked many girls after that fact, what would you rate this guy? Two, three, not just physically, his whole, his whole, everything about him is ultra fucking cringe and low value. Okay. And it's like pussy repellent. It's like, it's like if you had like, like just like an aura around you that just pushes all the pussy away. That's Tyler Durden. That's Owen Cook. Okay. That's these guys also. Okay. But now they can delude a whole following of impressionable young men who don't know any better and they can experience all the fame and all the, the fruits of, of having, you know, real success with women and real success with fitness and real success with business without possessing any of it. Okay, all they need to do is try to be cool on the camera and stir up a bunch of drama and all, and all this stupid shit and pretend like they're experts and entertain everyone. And everyone's like, oh, yeah, where, where can I get more fresh and fit? Okay, it's a total fucking disgrace. And it's very sad. Be happy. I'm here. Get the fuck out of here, bro. Like, no. Get the yeah, fuck the out of here, bro. No way, man. Facts. I didn't kick those other two girls out. It's because we had special guests on. And now he's trying to be even cooler. The only reason I didn't kick everyone off my show is because we had special guests on. Walter, if, if you make another comment, I'm going to kick you off. I might even kick myself off the show. This is, uh, this is our platform. We just do what we want. Facts. Okay, nah, bro. Right. Mm. I don't tolerate no fucking disrespect from women, bro. I don't tolerate no disrespect. Okay, then it's a double negation. Like none. I'm sure you don't, Myron. That's why you slam out fours and you don't bang nines and tens, and you pay girls a thousand dollars. Okay, as we showed in the Myron pays girls video, one thousand dollars to bang the girl and a three hundred dollar offer to come on their fucking sh totally worthless piece of shit show. Okay, that's 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 what he doesn't tolerate. Okay. Let's go to the last one here. Let's, let's see if there's any last remarks. In general, yeah, you don't want disrespect for nobody. Yeah, she had some. So, yeah, she yeah, made a dumbass no, no, comment no, no, in the no, beginning. No, no, oh, you're blocking me. It's my oh, fucking show, bro. Yeah. yeah. Okay, my show, bro. I don't that's think more that more should have been more. said. That this like that's not the time and place. Mm -hmm. I well, hear that. I hear that. I just gotta. I, I just gotta. I just wanna make that very clear, bro. That we don't need girls on our show like this. Yeah, that's always the message. We don't need any girls on our show, but we offer them $300 to come on and pretend like they like us and pretend like they think we're cool so we can get more views 
and more fucking sign-ups for our dumb shit, okay? But I want to make it clear, we don't need any of these girls, okay? Just so that's clear. It's an opportunity for you guys, you know what I'm saying? We're yeah. the one with the platform, you guys. We're the one with the whole scam image, okay? This is an opportunity for you guys. Don't forget it. You want to be here? Cool. But it's going to be a respect. If you don't want to, you don't have to be. Yeah, you don't have to be here, bro. We don't need you guys. Shit happens. You know, we're doing this thing. No, he's trying to be all coy. All right, let's look at the last one. And, and this fucking super annoying. It's, it's like, I feel like I'm like losing brain cells watching this. It, it, this. This is what it's come to. This Like, I came into this game, like, ready to, like, work with a whole bunch of people pushing this forward, innovating. Okay, I just released my field reports recently. Check that out. I just really, I showed a bunch of infield compilations of pulling. I showed a whole ton of pictures and receipts and hookup situations with lots of hot girls. Okay. And all these guys that show literally nothing because they're faking everything are going to come at me and, and talk a whole bunch of shit and slander my name and drag me through the mud. Okay. With a whole bunch of fabrications. And then I get to sit and analyze why they're fucking clowns and why they're, why they're all full of shit and all this stuff. It's, it's a losing battle. Okay. The, the, the fact remains that most people are going to just continue to be deluded by fucking fake pieces of shit. They're going to be scammed. They're going to be ripped off. Okay. The, the word can only get out so much. Okay. But <laughs> for those of you watching, now you know about these two fucking losers. No, well, you, you are. So get out. This is <laughs> yet another instance. Uh, and this is be now they think that now they've seen this is like stirring a buzz and this is like so cool for everyone. So now they're going to just do this a lot more. Put your put your shoes on outside. You don't got to put them on in here. Get out. Frank Castle moment. It just got real. Yeah. And these guys are trying to fucking hype up Myron's fake shit. It's it's so sad. Like, like seriously, it, it's times like this that I just, you know, I, I just have no words for, for how sad it is. And if you guys... <laughs> If you guys could have a window into my mind of how many horror stories I hear from guys that worked with these guys, from guys that worked with Modern Life Dating, that worked with the RSD fucking clowns, everyone is just getting taken for a ride, okay? And for those of you that doubt me because of all the slander claims, I show by far the most infields, the most pictures of hookup situations, the most fucking testimonials, the most vouching for by other advanced guys in the community. There's not one real shred of evidence for any fucking slander claims against me whatsoever. Okay, all the stuff about hiring hooker, it's all fabricated. All the stuff about, you know, faking it. I've never faked an infield, not even once. Okay. And it, I could bring on my fucking camera. I probably will. I'll bring on, and then you guys will say those are actors. I could bring on my five person camera crew, my old business partner that was filming a lot of the infield with me. And that was a lot of fucking work. Okay. And, it, and I put my fucking time in to this game, the blood, sweat, and tears. And like I said in other videos, I've, I've been responsible for driving a lot of the big innovations in this community. The setting dates straight to the house stuff, the wine dates, straight to, a lot of the stuff that Alex from Playing With Fire uh, pushes to his clients he got from me. But, we, but I got some good stuff from him as well uh, here and there. And, you know, that's fine. But, you know, I, I've put more value into this community than anyone I can think of. Okay, I've, I've constantly delivered the most practical, non-bullshit, straightforward advice that's systematic and efficient and effective and optimized. Okay, then you have the rest of the of the fucking coaches, and this is what they're doing. Okay, and behind the scenes, they're paying those girls for sex. It showed the proof of that, and they're paying those girls to come on the show. I really did. That's serious. Get the fuck out. Hey, guess what? Guess what that means? I mean, you can get on this. What'd you say? Yeah, you yeah. Yeah, don't don't start talking shit, man. Get on this side. Fuck out. Get on this side. Frank Castle in the building. Frank Castle in the building. He can say, "Get the fuck out." That makes him cool. That makes him alpha, right? Any real alpha guy watching this, and I've checked with a bunch, thinks this is ultra cringe and ultra beta behavior. Okay, you have to look past the surface. It's like when Tyler Durden's like, "Yeah, man, I bang all these tens about oh shit, better." No, he doesn't. Okay, he's a huge fucking loser. About as big of a loser as you can get. Okay. He just made a lot of money fucking tricking you guys. That way I can hear you. Fuck Ooh. out of here, man. Yeah. Okay. Your girl's uh, yep. <laughs> <laughs> She's gonna take your shit and get the fuck out. You're changing? Yeah. Wait, where, where, where's your shoes? Guys, yeah. this is crazy right now. What's going on? He always goes to make sure they leave. Hey, so my, girl, my girl that I got staying, so I don't know. Oh, you first? Okay. All right. Hey yo, before you leave, let me get that snap though. Yo, oh go get it, bro. Hey, hey yo, hey yo, hey yo, yo. <laughs> yeah, He's actually going for it. Just, uh, 
It's possible. Guys, this is really crazy right now. I know. I know what's happening eventually, guys. What happened? They get kicked out. I think, like, some I of the guys are not. Gotta end this in a few minutes. I have to go fucking run my mentorship where all the guys are fucking crushing it for real with real strategy and real tactics from a real expert. Okay, this guy on the right here is about as big of a scammer as you can get. Yeah, for so yeah. Do we catch it all? It's <laughs> okay, so we <laughs> are talking, talking too loud and then Marvin was like, nah. That's it. Yeah, thanks for recapping, Walter. It's so Yo, this is crazy, right, Nessie? Yeah, that's crazy, right? And when you fucking watch this, Myron and Walter, make a fucking response, okay? Be the man that you are. I already called out Modern Life Dating to show any receipts, okay? To show any girls, hookup situations, any infields, okay? He came in, into this field. He was working for a uh, Modern Life Dating, was working as a recruiter for a medical devices company, okay? Less than three years ago and in, in managing Airbnb properties. And then he came in and took a whole bunch of people's products, as I've shown in multiple videos, including my products, including off of, off of Player Supreme, who's dead. Okay, and he's just a massive piece of shit who wants to just slander the fuck out of me at this point once I call them out for doing that, okay? So let's wrap up. <laughs> Guys, let's see some house, by the way. Yo, let's see you say to the, to the, to the Real fans? talk. I need a drink. Are you kicked out and you're I'm asking for her Snapchat? Hey, That's yeah. the real wrong timing. Hey, I ain't gonna lie, that was yeah. pretty funny. Myron's like, hey man, I did it. Let's get my, my recognition. Wrong timing. Bruh. Oh my gosh. All right. That was spectacular. <laughs> nice try, though. <laughs> uh, don't worry, guys. Yeah. We'll post that on Instagram later. <laughs> no, no, I yeah. take them hoes out. So. Like, uh, now he's calling girls hoes to seem even cooler and add dramatic effect. Fucking. <laughs> 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 All right. Uh, read some chats. Uh, we got okay. some super chats. And Telegram. Okay. Hey. Look at his shirt. Eye power. The, when you guys see the email he sent me, hey, I don't know what I'm doing in game. I'm banging four, so. None of my crew knows what they're doing. Hey, or, or the text messages. Hey, bro, just give me a boot camp for $500. The, the boot camp's almost $4,000. He's like, no, just do it for five hundred dollars because he didn't have that much money like two years ago. Right? Now he has all you retards that are fans of these guys fucking paying them, paying for this fucking apartment and shit. Okay? Good job. I'm sure you guys are all crushing it, right? Everybody, everybody that watches this channel is crushing it with the girls and with business and with fitness, right? You're learning business off guys that know nothing about business. You're learning fitness from guys that are just putting out very basic recycled plans. And don't even get me started on what these guys know about dating. Okay, it's, it's close to zero. Hey, Nessie, you want to get on? Um, no. Nessie was an enforcer. She was like, don't talk shit in here. Yeah. Like, oh, you, you, was, you said that? She came and worked yeah, it out. Yeah, Nessie was like, yo. I'm this is just like fucking pure trash. All they're doing is just, is just playing off of like the draw to reality TV. Stirring up fake drama, trying to be cool. All this stuff. It's, 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 it's just so dumb. Our world is so dumb. It's very sad. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Oh, you look like you choke, guys. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Nessie, come say hello to the she people, She can man. choke bi just, uh, bitches with that bicep. Yeah, man. Oh, my God. Nessie, say what's up to the people. <laughs> hey, Nessie. That was funny. Yeah, is Nessie single? Hi. Yeah, she's single. Uh, she's single? Yeah. Yeah. You like to choke, guys? I like being choked. Oh. Can you do both? This is going to be an interview with, like, three. He's like, oh no, bro, they're, they're just here, blah, blah, blah. And then, the $1,200? I was like, oh my God. <laughs> We're so hot. We got plenty, plenty, plenty um, promoters hitting, hitting us up to go to the club. I'm like, bro. Well, Congratulations, guys. You, you did it. You tricked everyone. Okay. Uh, I have to jump off to my mentorship. Thank you so much for watching. If you'd like to actually get really, really good results that are real from a real expert, jump on a free 30 minute call with me. Link in the description. Also, if you're not a subscriber, please subscribe below and get updated about new videos every single day. This is sad as fuck. It, our, our whole community is in a, uh, it, it's, it's just, a, it's very, 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 very sad. The whole community is, is just a, a laughing stock, okay? It's been infiltrated by scammers and fake fucking pieces of shit like these two guys, okay? And I'm, I'm doing my best to let everybody know what's going on, okay? I'm taking all the backlash straight to the fucking face by these fucks retaliating, okay? So, Thank you so much for watching, and let's keep fighting the good fight. I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care. Some do it for the income, but we do it for the outcome. Some of us are active, while others just let their mouth run. No doubt, son, this is not just about fun. We will not be outdone by these cowards who shout scum.